Hey, happy campers. Todd here at Great American RV Superstores. Today, we want to talk about the override of a cable-driven slide. How do we override it in the event that the motor goes out or something goes wrong? So let's hop in. You can identify a cable slide by the cables right here on the top and bottom of the slide out walls. You'll have one on each side. Everything else is on the inside, so let's go check it out. So on the inside of our unit, first thing I'll tell you to do before we go into the steps of uh, disabling or bypassing this unit is we want to check our breaker panel, make sure that no 12 volt fuses are bad in there, make sure we got good battery power. Check all these things. It might be a simple fix before having to jump in and, and do this extra work. Next thing you're going to want to do is take a little flathead screwdriver, kind of pop it up in here, or maybe even be able to pull a little bit from the top and wiggle these slide faces off of there. They're going to be put in there with little brad nails. And don't pull too hard. Don't yank it off because you will tear that up. So be careful as you're pulling that out. Once again, be careful because they're going to have nails behind it as well. Once you get that off, you'll be able to access your motor and be able to do the steps that we're about to show you. We can see our cable driven slide here. It's a gearbox on the right hand side and then the motor on the outer end. You see a little small circle. That is where our bit is going to go. Here we're inserting that bit and going to hook up our flexible drill attachment. Once that's hooked in, we can go to town with the drill and start pulling in our slide out. So once your slide out is all the way in, there's no need for two by fours or bracing in order to keep that slide out from going out because that motor is still locked in. Now, if you had a chain pop off or one of the cables broke or something like that, it's a good idea to probably go ahead and put a two by four or a locking arm in there to make sure that slide doesn't slide out while you're traveling down the road. So these are some safety precautions you wanna take. Hope this helped you out in a jam. Keep watching our videos. We have plenty more on the YouTube section of our channel. It's called Helpful Hacks. Watch them, share them, like them, comment on them, put on your notifications so you don't miss the next one. And keep watching here at Great American RV Superstores where we bring the how-to to you.